I'm Humphrey Nagmanya from Uganda and I work with uh, NBS TV where I host a youth program that uh, directly targets the young people in addressing the sexual and reproductive health needs within the young people. I started up an organization where I'm a founder and this organization is called Richer Hand Uganda. It reaches out to young people more using uh, the peer education tool. We use role models who are the celebrities in our country to address the reproductive health issues and also the needs of these young people. We are trying to change people's attitude and mostly that Uganda is the country with the youth population over like 79 percent full of young people and what role are we playing as young people to address the sexuality of young people, try to address the rights of these young people so that they can understand and make their proper choices right. The activities that Richard Hand does, it does peer education, it does peer mentorship programs, it has media outreaches in terms of advocacy, in terms of reaching out to young people. And into this we have school outreaches, we have community outreaches where we reach young people who have dropped out of schools. We hold camps whereby we bring in different young people, partner up with different corporate companies so that we can address sexual productive health issues that can really create positive attitude. Recently we have a project called the Get Your Mix Out campaign where the theme is My Body, My Life, My Choice speaks directly to the young people. We have the campaign called One Week in December to prolong the World AIDS Day into five days. In those five days we're talking about HIV and AIDS and in that we're changing people's attitude, we're creating a responsibility within the community. What totally inspired me was my background that I grew up from. My parents were HIV positive and I came up with the need to fight against HIV and AIDS by changing the attitudes of people, mostly the young people they will be fighting HIV and AIDS. If you address issues of sexuality, if you address issues of reproductive health, that means you're giving proper choices, you're giving information to the young society so that the choices are made by them. Looking in three years, my vision is bigger. Right now we're operating more of a, in, a, in, in a small area, that is the, uh, the central region. But in three years we want to cover the whole country. We want to see ourselves expanding and being a national organization that covers the whole country, reaches out to different areas and we are lobbying for that and we want to see that happen.